Hello and welcome to another Things to Watch Whilst Waiting for Stranger Things 3 to return to our screens. Today we're going to be talking about Stephen King's Carrie. Carrie, whatever you want to call it. Carrie, I call her. Carrie. Um, it's pronunciations uh, different to American and British. Anyway, uh, basically this is a woman, or a young lady as I should say, that uh, just goes about through puberty. Uh, her mum doesn't tell her about this and she has the ability of doing things with her mind um, basically if you haven't seen the bit where she's uh, the famous scene where she gets covered in blood on the prom in her prom in her prom dress on the stage and uh, I don't know where you've been anyway this is Sissy Spacek and John Travolta two uh, big uh, movie stars especially John Travolta he starts going in Greece doesn't he and uh, must have a film that is in the 70s uh, doesn't do much now does he um, anyway this is from 1976 so it's uh, a lot earlier than my last video of Firestarter um, yes uh, the greatest modern day horror movie they have remade it with um, I've forgotten that girl's name from 2013 and uh, it's not as good um, always watch the original before you watch the remake as I always say as uh, just like the thing uh, and all that I'll just do the thing hopefully soon that should be uh, an upcoming one anyway Stephen King bestseller Kerry so um at the centre of the terror is Kerry, a tortured high school misfit with no confidence, no friends and no idea about the extent of her secret power of telekinesis. Uh, again, if you know what I'm on about, then you can see straight away this is to do with Eleven from Stranger Things, telekinesis powers. Um, but when her psychotic mother and sadistic classmates finally go too far, the once shy teen becomes an estranged vengeance seeking powerhouse who will the, who with the help of her special gift causes all hell to break loose in a framed cinematic frenzy of blood fire and brimstone that will take you to the very depths of horror and beyond um yeah basically it's a girl who is very well her mum is a bit of a, a bit of a bitch as uh, as we all call her I did say that on screen but uh, it's very true um, her mum didn't like doing anything with her um, she didn't even tell her that well about puberty or anything and um, yeah so the book itself this is the American version I believe um, for some reason I did order the British version but same thing aren't they, they're going to be the same it's just a couple of spellings maybe that um, they twitch to uh, get the English to understand because uh, yeah anyway um, again this is a very good story um, I don't know what else to say about it really apart from go and watch it um, this and Firestarter two of the main um, backgrounds for Eleven um, she, uh, she's got telekinesis hasn't she and she's very much like um, Charlie from Firestar um, there's also another movie called from Phenomenon uh, which I'll do a review next of similar to um, Eleven that stars Jennifer Connelly and uh, if you haven't seen that one it's very Stephen King-ish it's not a Stephen King um, you know film uh, it's made by some Italian fella um, anyway that's for an upcoming review anyway thank you very much for watching hope you've enjoyed and we shall speak soon bye bye